Giants always did enjoy hiding their secrets in plain sight. Wait until you see this. Ah, yes. Here we have Groa's search for her missing husband. She was relentless in her attempt to find him. Meditated for weeks on end. Unfortunately, she found... something else. A vision of Ragnarok. Word of Groa's vision reached Odin. He sought her out. Demanded a private retelling. Didn't like what he heard, apparently. Ironwood? That's the... I don't know what that is. The mythical sanctuary for giants. Curious. So it's in Jotunheim? I know some giants thought so, but Ironwood isn't anywhere, lad. It's a concept, a metaphorical paradise. It's not real. Presumably, Groa requested her ashes be returned to Jotunheim, while her soul found peace in the light. Difficult to imagine Odin respecting those wishes. Hmm. The champion? I think it's supposed to be... Me. You assume too much. Aye. Best not to read into these abstractions so literally. Prophecies are slippery by nature. Although, some are more obvious than others. Ragnarok. Aye. The end of everything. So this is it. There's nothing we can do to stop it. There must be a way. Why else is this hidden? Look. Here. This is what we saw. It's you. Fighting in Ragnarok. No. I don't. I can't. What's this then? That's new. Asgard is destroyed? But the other realms thrive? She did. <laughs> Odin's working off a false prophecy. <laughs> so then, we can win Ragnarok. We can beat Odin. We are not present in any of this. But that was Tyr leading the charge against Asgard. Plus, Hell's army was there. And the elves. Champion. Okay. Whoever that is, doesn't matter. But for the first time, we know something Odin doesn't. We just saw we can win. Tyr? I won't allow prophecy to define my choices. But, but we just saw No, you. 
Atreus, this is wrong. Come, there is much to discuss. We can't stop Ragnarok, but we can win it. If Asgard is destroyed, Odin will not be the only casualty. There must be another way. <laughs> so, what'd you see? A lot. Groa lied to Odin. Ragnarok isn't the end of everything. It's just the end of Asgard. Just the destruction of an entire realm, is it? To say nothing of its citizen and its wildlife. Those ignorant and innocent of Odin's misdeeds. Enough. There is much to discuss once we are safe at home. Huh. That might be my best piece yet today. Wear it with pride. And in pristine condition, too. Do you believe in fate, Sindri? Oh, of course not. You think I'd wash my hands this much if I thought that what I do doesn't ultimately matter? There's only one thing with any say over how we live our lives, and that's us. Perhaps we should focus on our egress first. Agreed. <laughs> Oh, 
Yeah! 
left side, brother! Is over. It is far from over. I... It's gonna be okay, dear. You've seen what is to come. I told you I would not follow you to war, and yet here I am, dragging an innocent, innocent? elf and marching towards the destruction of Asgard. What choice do we have? There is always a choice. I will not lead you to war. I won't. I'm not that god anymore. I don't want to fight, but with you three, there is no avoiding it. Your path leads to countless deaths, unimaginable pain and suffering. Hey, dear? 
Thanks. And I'm sorry about before. I... No. I am sorry. I should never have come. We shouldn't linger. do the right thing and according to prophecy speak no more of prophecy war will not give you the purpose you seek atreus any slaughter so what are we supposed to do roll over do nothing enough we will discuss our next move when we are out of danger Father, this way! 
Up here. Let's keep moving. Can we leave now, please? Almost there. This way. Here. Open the gateway, please. the legacy this one has left for the barons. I've had far more than I can stomach. We do not need to rush. We should see this desert for ourselves. Look, I know we can't trust prophecy, but I'm not sure we should just ignore what we saw either. We are not ignoring it. We will discuss it back home. For now, I wish to search for the wounded animal you heard earlier. You? Really? Yes. Well, 
Okay, then. Good. Yeah. Lead the way. We should be able to reach the barons up top. Once we find a way past this hive matter. I remember these things. Definitely Dark Elf territory. Hail, fellow travelers! Atreus heard a creature in pain in the desert. Over a storm like this? Most impressive. You know Alfheim pretty well, right? Do you have any idea what's out there? No, sorry. The elves and I... Long story, but it's best when we keep out of each other's way. Hive matter is... stickier than I care for. Good luck on your search, though. Stuff some cloth in your ears to keep the sand out. Don't knock it till you've tried it. What are these animals? Gulon, native to Vanaheim. Not sure what they're doing here. Someone trained them to pull a sled. Lucky for us. Domesticated Gulon. Most unusual. Father, is it always moral to kill something that's trying to kill you? Yes. Well, there you have it, lad. Any particular direction to find your wounded animal? Or are we just enjoying the weather? I can't hear anything out here. Perhaps we find a cave first to catch our bearings? A tempting treasure chest! Damn the sand!
There's a cave entrance!
cave extends underneath the desert. Is the creature within? Yeah, sounds like it. We'll find it if we keep going. Hmm. What is this place? A refuge for the Dark Elves, by the looks of it. One of the few remaining now that they're barred from the temple. <sighs> Great. We didn't have to fight them. They attack us. Well, this is their home. And considering what happened the last time we were in Alpha, can we really blame them? Patience. A virtue or a threat? Depends on the reader.
The creature you heard, what does it say now? It's not always like that. Some animals are just... I feel what they're feeling, you know? And whatever this thing is, it's in a lot of pain. I see. Why do you ask? I am curious. Really? I am capable of curiosity. Okay. Okay. something. I think we gotta hit it from the other side.
disinterested before. When I talk to animals or enchanted rings or whatever. Much has changed for both of us. Well, yeah. I'm just trying to figure out why you'd help some random animal. Is this not what you want? No, no, it, it is. I'm just surprised it's what you want, too. <laughs> Watch your right! <laughs> 
to abandon it but if we have to kill a bunch of dark elves to get there i remember a young lad whom until this very moment would take on an army of draugr to save a wounded animal but these aren't undead draugr they're elves i just want to make sure we're not repeating the same mistakes getting involved where we shouldn't <laughs> <laughs> 